What's going on Xbox and YouTube and as you can see we are checking out some brand new GTA 5 next gen easter eggs with the peyote plants here. You are basically allowed to turn into any random animal. Now this one will I believe turn into a seagull which I did not do very well at flying. I basically crashed it right into the side of the mountain. But check it out anyway guys I am a seagull. I'm a seagull. What? Yep, and then I crashed. As you can see, I crashed instantly. But there is one of three, and I will show you guys two more that I found. So sit back, relax, and check them out. And yeah, guys, I massively failed at that one. But okay, we are on to the second one. The second one is on top of this, like, mountain, like, in between. Uh, it's really hard. I'll show it to you guys on the map right here. This is the location of the second one. And you pretty much are going to have a rough time getting up here unless you use a helicopter. Or in my case, I used a dirt bike and pretty much wall climbed up here. But right here is the second peyote plant that I have found. And this one will turn you into another bird, which can either be a seagull, um, a falcon, or a crow. And I believe I'm turning into a crow on this one, so check it out. Why? Oh, why? Oh, why? Oh. And as you can see, fellas, I am now a crow. You can fly, and you can actually uh, aerial attack people. And the funniest one, if you press RT, you can poop, <laughs> which I found hilarious. But yeah, this is the second peyote plant I found, and I've turned into a crow here. And a little bit later on, I will show you some better images if I can. But yeah, this is the second one, guys. This is only available in the next gen councils, so check them out. must suck being you. You suck. I don't. And you do. I'm amazing. I've never been better. Wow. I'm the best. Oh, this is great. I'm great. And this is great. And you're not. <laughs> wow. All right, guys, and here is a better view of the crow. I tried to get into a brighter area, but it would not stop raining and lightning and thunderstorming to save my life. So this is the best image I could capture of that one. And on to the third and final one I have found this week. Alright guys, now we are going on to the shark, which is actually right by like the ferris wheel, right by the pier here, and you want to basically go right by this one pier that seems to be sticking out and dive straight down. And it's kind of on the left hand side of the pier if you're facing the, the ferret right there, like see it right here, there we go, we finally got it, going into first person mode to get a better angle. And this one will turn you into a stingray, a fish, or a shark. If you guys want to experience all three on each peyote plant, you're going to have to disable your auto save feature and make sure you save the game before you go to each one of these. So you can restart and try each one of them. I mistakenly did not do that. But here you guys see I am the, f the, the bull shark here. And you can actually eat people and bite them, which I tried to do. But it's quite hard, as you can see, to actually see where you're going the closer you get to shore. So it was kind of a difficult thing to do, but pretty awesome nonetheless. And for those of you who do not know, there are 28 or 29 peyote plants. And at the final plant, once you have collected them all, there is another secret Easter egg that nobody has quite figured out. And nobody really knows what it is yet. But do your best to find all 28 of them, and you will find out. So once again, everyone, thank you for watching.